Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. This is Easy from RZ Easy Customizer. We build, we share, and we inspire. This week, I'm back with another episode of Let's Customize featuring Bandai 30 Minutes Mission Plastic Model Kit. In this video, let's build a transformable marine type of mecha. Previously, I already shared the tutorials on how to make a transformable jet fighter, my first tank design, the dual cannon, the four-legged mech and a machine inspired by a watcher from Horizon Zero Dawn game. You guys can check out all my previous episode. Links are in the description down below. So, this time around, let me bring you guys to the ocean. This build is using two model kits from 30 Minutes Mission, which are the Porta Nova Marine Type and the Extended Armament Attack Submarine. I have both blue in color. They are matching perfectly together and there's no glue there's no sanding there's no cutting are needed for this tutorial first step is to disassemble some parts from porta nova pull out this hat because i want to use the other hat design and then pull out this backpack we only need these two giant tanks at the back and then these two shoulder guards we need that too and these tiny parts here Pull them out because I don't really like this part actually but if you guys love them just leave it there next for the extended armament attack submarine remove this part and leave one for this build pull out these two white parts we need them both these handles well we only need one this weapon part at the back we need that too pull out this hat and yes we need that for this design and this joint here remove it this huge tanks remove them too we don't need them and then these two parts here yes we need that for this build of course we need to use three millimeter size of runner for us to make a new connection or melt packs just tiny three millimeter spur like this time to assemble first step is split the porta nova into half grab the lower part first we need these two tanks at the front become the rear tanks just simply rotate both legs and put back the upper body part grab the new hat and put it inside this ball joint grab this part and put it behind the arm do the same thing for the other one grab the giant tank and put this black part here and do the same thing for the other one Next, we're gonna make the backpack. Grab the three millimeter spur runner and make a new melt pack like this. So we can attach the giant tanks on both sides. Put this white part at the front, use this hole right here and do the same thing on the other side. Make a shark looking fin at the back using this part. Rotate both wings for the backpack mode and simply attach the backpack behind the Porta Nova. For the remaining parts, assemble them like this so we have a sword type of weapon. Grab another piece of spur runner and put it at the back here. This is for the transformation later on. This is a new look of Porta Nova Marine type, a very simple looking design. So next, let's transform it into the submarine type. Remove the sword, split the Porta Nova into half, rotate the wings of the backpack like this. Make sure the tank thrusters are facing backwards. Reposition the Porta Nova downwards and rotate the both arms at 90 degree angle and bend this part like this. Do the same thing for the other one. Next, the lower part. Lift this side skirts up, extend the joints here downward. Make sure to do this carefully. Bend the legs to the front and rotate them about 90 degree angle in this position. Move these two small tanks at the back at this angle and put back down the side skirts. Attach the lower part using the pack that we made under the backpack. Once you got that, make sure every parts are perfectly in place. Final step, pull out the sword handle and attach the sword at the back like this. So, here is the submarine type of Porta Nova. It's pretty simple and needs some parts former type of transformation. 
this is only the basic design if you are planning to make one you can use this idea and transformation steps and add more parts that you have to make it looks much cooler than this that's all the video for today on let's customize series i have more to share for you guys in the future so stay tuned stay safe don't forget to subscribe my channel to support me and i see you guys next time ciao thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe my channel and follow me on rz easy customizer facebook page and my instagram rz easy the links are in the description down below i do customizing i do kit bashing reviews tutorials and many more because here on rz easy customizer we build we share and we're inspired see you guys next time ciao